Hi, welcome to Howcast. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make your very own survival kit. This can be used for hikers, hunters, anything really, campers, anything. First of all, you're going to get a little tin. I've got my waterproof tin, as you can see, with the waterproof seal on the side. Just going to open that. Okay. So here we have survival tin. I want to ignore that MSN. Oops. Alright. Here's the things that my survival tin consists of. A button compass. Very important to know where you're going if you're lost. Some waterproof. Oh. I don't think you get Waterproof safety matches, so get away if it's all right. <clears throat> a wire saw, so you can, you can cut down some kindle if you need to. Emergency whistle, so signaling if you, a helicopter or something. Obviously, they won't be able to hear you in a helicopter, that's why heliograph is poor. Uh, but this, I don't know. If you're in the middle of the ocean, for instance, boats come in. It's a bit loud. Yeah, you get the idea with that. Some nylon string. We'll get to what that's for in a second. <clears throat> a candle. Basically, you don't want to be lighting more than one match at a time. Save your matches. This is for lighting other things like you would light the match burst from the striker on the side you would light the candle and then you would um, light other bits of wood from anything off this yeah you get the idea what oh, that's well light as well next you have your <coughs> set snare wire basically if you you I put a little book in my so I would tune with um how to make animal traps, so you're out in the wild, you're going to have to eat, so you're going to have to make a trap for animals. Striker and flint, I think you can guess what that's for. You know, I'm not obviously going to do it inside because I'll make them, yeah. Sewing kit, I can't see it inside because it's stapled up, but... There is uh, different assorted kinds of, yeah, you get cotton, different colours. Because obviously, if you're on the run, say, behind enemy lines or something, your clothes are going to deteriorate. Safety pins. Multi-purpose, really. So explanatory why you need those. A lock knife, basically just cutting anything, can also be used for other things as well if you want. Water purification tablets, if, if you're on the, I don't know, run like in the SAS or something, you go behind enemy lines, you're going to drink water upstream. It won't taste very nice, but yeah, as that man on the SS, but it says it keeps you alive, doesn't it? A pencil. Like to keep a diary of what you're doing, it keeps you sane. If there's no one around, it keeps you alive. Now, getting back to the. If I can find it. The nylon string. You have here. Weights and fishing hooks. You're on the run, you need to catch your dinner. So that's what they're for. And here, the last but not least thing I have in here my survival piece of paper. Tells you how to make a trap, stuff like that. You get the idea of that. But. So, yeah, these are only supposed to be used in a survival situation. Now I'm just going to show you how I pack it back all together again. 
Start with the like flat objects on the bottom, such as your purification tablets, your wire, your uh, safety pins, stuff that's not going to take a lot of room, really. Your button compass, should keep that in the corner. Square things in the corner, pencil, that side, whistle, candle, keep thing on. Actually, to light, that should go there, there. Go around there. Striker and flint should go up there. There. Let's put that in. Wrap it around there. Having a bit of a bad day, to be honest. <laughs> Right, they're in. That's there. There. That probably should have gone on the bottom. There. And if I'm not missing anything. Now, you probably want to. Don't break the waterproof. You probably will need to break the waterproof seal on it. But if you buy one of these pre made, it's going to keep you. And um, you probably want to. Break it open first to get everything out of these little packets because they come in little packets. So, yeah, thank you for watching and goodbye.